Good afternoon, actually good morning. Rich Nass with Embedded Community Design at Embedded World, booth 121. It's actually the Embedded Community Design booth where we have lots of other people. One of those groups is Picnic. I'm here with Doug Sandys, the CTO of Picnic. I know you wear lots of hats, but this is a pretty important one. And uh, you guys are doing a whole bunch of IoT type things. What are some of the issues you're trying to help developers solve these days? Yeah, thanks Rich. Um, there's actually multiple problems or challenges in the IoT space. And when PicMig started looking at IoT, um, back in about 2018 is when the genesis of our IoT work, we saw that the standardization at the sensor level and the, we call it effectors level, that's the, the motors and valves, was one impediment to moving forward with large scale deployments of mm -hmm. industrial IoT. And that's, that's where PicMig is focused is industrial IoT. The but, legacy stuff. Well, you might say legacy. We think of it as, as what makes our countries run, right? That's fair. Factories yeah, and, absolutely. and automation, uh, transportation, energy. So that's what we're talking about for IoT. And um, so what we're trying to do is provide data models. That's ways of representing the information that's coming off of these sensors and, and effectors, mm -hmm. and also data models that that allow you to control valves and actuators and motors in ways that, that factory personnel need to do that. Right? So we're working on that. And is the problem because these were not really meant to be controlled in that way? Um, yeah, good question. So uh, if you look out there in the sensor domain today or the motor domain today, there's really very few smart sensors or motors, ones that can communicate with a, a larger IoT infrastructure. In fact, most sensors today, if you purchase one, you're going to find three wires or two wires mm -hmm. analog that you have to hook up to something else to provide intelligence. And that's right now providing market fragmentation because there's a million different ways you can hook these things up. Mm -hmm. What PicMig is doing, and we've always focused on doing this, is providing standards that accelerate the market by providing interoperability. So with one unified data model, the sensors then always, they all speak the same language. We've already enabled with IoT.1, that's our, our firmware specification, um, plug and play interoperability of sensors and effectors. Uh, we have demonstrated that uh, actually last year at another show, at Sensors Converge show. Um, and now we're working on the higher layers of abstraction. So how do you, how do you bubble that information up into um, a collection of devices that make up a piece of factory equipment? And then you can worry about um, problems like scheduling and efficiency at that level. Very good. To learn more about this, come on over to booth 121 in Hall 1. You can talk to Doug right here.